5.30, a community in mourning. A soldier who aspired to be a member of the U.S. Special Forces was killed in a training accident. Staff Sergeant Alexander Delita grew up in Dunstable. And those who knew him, this father and husband, say he always wanted to serve. WBC's Bill Shields has the story. Today in Dunstable, flags were at half staff for 32-year-old Alex Delita, a young man who grew up here, then went off to serve his country. Yes, they do volunteer work, they donate their time, they, they serve on various committees. He was only 32, but highly decorated. Staff Sergeant Delita was with the Army Airborne and stationed here at Fort Bragg in North Carolina. Yesterday, during training, something went wrong, and reports indicate there was an explosion where seven soldiers were injured and Staff Sergeant Delita was killed. I wouldn't be surprised if Alexander, being the type of person he was, may have realized what happened and tried to save everybody else. The commander of the Special Warfare School said the Special Operations community is a close-knit family. Staff Sergeant Delita's death is a reminder that a soldier's job is inherently dangerous. At his family's home today, the flag was flying over the front door, and a police officer protected the family's privacy. And here in Dunstable, they remember the All-American kid probably more so than the decorated airborne sergeant. Great young man, and as we saw him, you know, grow and mature, uh, uh, he clearly, you know, had his heart and mind set on uh, serving in the military and, and uh, serving for America and our protection and our freedom. Alex Delita spent much of his adult life in the military, so it's still unclear right now whether or not he'll be buried here or somewhere around Fort Bragg. In Dunstable, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.